Did you all know this was a game? So they have just come out with a new CCG called the My Hero Academia Collectible Card Game. Um, a locals that I had right by me had this on pre-release, so I figured I might as well get it. I have some stuff coming in the mail too, um, but I'm a huge My Hero Academia fan, and so I thought this would be kind of cool to do. And obviously I like card games, so... Uh, put one and two together, and we got this. So I'm actually going to try to play the card game, too. Uh, we'll see how it goes. I know Universe has been doing stuff for a while, but uh, let me open this. Get my handy-dandy scissors here. Like I said, I do have some more pre-order stuff coming in, but I know it's on pre-release right now, and that is... The game's not releasing for another little bit, so I would like to get a video out for anyone that you know hasn't been able to get it yet or doesn't even know this exists because a lot of people like my hero academia so when you open it um we can actually look on the back real quick you get uh it says right here you get 251 card rival decks um featuring izuku midoriya and um katsuke bakugo and two random ultra rare cards from the My Hero Academia card game. So, should be pretty cool. So when you open it, you get these two decks right here, which I will set off to the side. And if you open it farther, you get a couple other things here. We'll put this off to the side. Pretty cool case though. You get uh, the playmat, so I'll, I'll show one of the playmats. Um, let's do the Midoriya one. They'll look the same. So you have... Here, let me, uh, let me back this up here. Let's see if I can show you a little taller. Um, so that's what the the whole thing looks like so pretty cool there um different zones and everything if you want to learn how to play i honestly haven't really learned how to play yet but i would like to learn so i've been looking at tutorials and everything so if you're interested make sure there's some really good ones on youtube that i've been watching so make sure you check those out and i will try to learn in the meantime so if you want to know how to play obviously there's a how to play thing but i should be able to show you that as well so you get two starter decks here. Um, we're gonna start with the Bakugo one. This is really cool. I'm super excited for this. So pretty easy to open. We're gonna open that, put this off to the side. All right, we're gonna, here let's, uh, we can zoom in a little bit more now. We can take a little bit of a closer look through these. So we have a Katsuki Bakugo, very cool. Obviously if you watch how to play it too, here's like the um, defense or shield, this is the check value, this is um, damage or play value, um, this is how many cards you can have in your hand, this is the total life. And then these are like attributes and then different effects that they have. So start with one of those, very cool. We have uh, two blast rush turbo it's even if you don't like it for the um the game it's still really cool to collect these two exploding pride one howlitzer impact two instant explosive release am i getting some sort of glare on those two okay hopefully that's a little better um three long lasting explosion we have three monster blast, two point blank incineration, two signature right swing. So these are all attack cards. So they're um, in the like the orangish color. And then you get to these that are more gray. Um, these are called foundation cards. So if you've watched any um, tutorials or anything, you'll see what these are. 
Um, this is agitation. The other one was aggressive temper. We have arrogant disposition. Burst speed. We have uh, capabilities. Very cool. Uh, encouragement, we have three of those. In danger, we have four of those. Uh, latent skill, we have four of those. Let's fight bad guys, four of those. And here is, ooh, very cool. This is our, um, a random ultra rare from the set. So this is Evil Gaze, and I think Evil Gaze, I have my, my chart right here. Let me see how much, how much it is. Is it sold for anything? Uh, one sold pre-sale. We don't go by pre-sales though. Going by for about 17 bucks right now. So that's, that's not bad. Pretty cool. Very, very cool. So next we have the Izuku Midoriya. I'll get the Bakugo ones out of the way before I do the Midoriya deck. Then also stay tuned because given my camera can hold the memory, tomorrow I will be doing a booster box of this as well. That's really cool. It comes with a random um, ultra rare as well. So we start with the main man himself, Izuku Midoriya, or Deku. That's so cool. And it's, it's like hollow, really cool looking card. Um, we have Aspiring Punch. We have two of those. We have three Delaware Smash. This is a really cool looking card. This is really cool. Let's see if I can get more. I still need to figure out how to get the lighting the best. But look at that. That looks, that looks awesome. So we got one Determined Victory Smash. Three Future Charge, two Heroic Smash, two Reverse Throw, two Setup Strike, two Velocity Punch, and now we're on to the found, or Foundations. We have Bonds of Friendship, four of those. We have four Gift from Mom, four Good Impression, four Note Taking, Four passing the torch, uh, one planning ahead, and this one is also a hollow card, which is really cool. The hollows, like, yeah, I like the hollows a lot. They're really nice. Um, four recovery girls kiss. Two rigorous training. Four self sacrifice, and what are we gonna get for our random ultra rare? We have a tape swing. Let's see what we have for our tape swing. Let's see what the, if we can find the price on that. We're looking at it. Okay, this is about the same as um, the Evil Gaze. So, not bad, pretty cool. So yeah, that's um, mostly what comes in it. You're gonna get a random ultra rare there, and I think that's really cool to throw in there. But we should be back for the box opening tomorrow. So I'm gonna have more stuff coming in too, and my goal is to learn how to play this game. So. If you want to pick it up, I would definitely recommend it from what I've seen from it. And even if you, like I said, don't want to play the game, artwork's pretty dang cool. So this is all I have. We'll see you tomorrow. JJ's Cards. See you later.